Good morning, good people. As you can see, I'm not in my normal studio. Um, I just wanted to come quick so I didn't have a chance to uh, change over, all right? If you're new to the page, hit the like, subscribe, notification bell. Let's get right into what's happening today. Um, so the markets are going through a sell-off like we knew. We were prepared for this if you've been following the page. All right. So there is a uh, debt payment deadline looms for a Chinese property developer named Evergrade. OK. And because the Chinese market is selling off, the European markets are selling off. These are our futures for us because they their markets are open before ours, of course. And it's causing kind of like a, a worldwide sell off. Right. That is not all that's happening. Our market was this is the worst week like i've been saying any little thing would have caused it to have a sell-off i personally believe that it would have been selling off anyway remember two months ago i said mid-september two months ago and so it's it's we're not surprised we are prepared and so there's a lot of opportunity out there uh crypto crypto has had a sell-off Crypto has been down as much as 10 percent at opening bell at the at the time of recording this. OK, so I got a lot going on here. I just want to give you guys information. I have uh, CNBC up watching it and um, they're just going through everything I want to see when they show the charts. So uh, we can keep you guys updated. So I made a video. Uh, about uh, a couple of things. One, let's bounce over to crypto. I said crypto um, in specific uh, ADA. I was looking at ADA. I said, I see a buy-in at around $2, but then down to $1.80. So in my Weeble app, I put a buy order in at $2 and it bought in already. Let's take a look at where it is right now. Uh, yep, we're at 215. Uh, so it bought in at two, and now now it's up to 215. Uh, for those of you out there that are buying dips in the crypto, okay. But remember, it's Monday. This week is going to be a volatile week. It's Monday. So what do we do not do? We do not try to catch a falling knife. Even with my crypto purchase, I didn't go all the way in. I split my money up into four parts. So I only bought one fourth of ADA. Okay. And of course you guys know I'm looking at Solano also, but in the stock market, I left a entire list from four of the top YouTubers. Well, not top YouTubers, but four uh, YouTubers. And we left an entire list of stock that you guys need to consider adding to your portfolios in times like this. The reason I did that a whole experiment was to prepare us for such a time as this. Okay. It's only Monday. Uh, it, this is going to be a roller coaster week. And when I mean, for those of you that are new, not to catch a falling knife, we just, this, it may dip today and you may think it's over and it could dip just as much tomorrow, right? And so we got to be careful on what we're buying. But for those of you that are buying long term stock, like you want to hold for 10, 20 years. Now's the time to start looking at the list that all of these YouTubers have provided. OK, so that was the whole reason why this experiment. Remember, I want to give you guys good news. I'm sorry. I want to prepare you guys. And sometimes it's good news. Sometimes it's bad news. But we want to be prepared, good people. So that's what's important. All right. So, yeah, the, the Dow is down. Let's look at it. I'm here live in real time. But I know I'm not live here because at the end of this, I want to reiterate the stock that um, all of these YouTubers have given because I want this video to be helpful. So right now the Dow is down 480, NASDAQ is down 244, S&P down 60. Okay. So there is a little comeback. And, um, so remember this week is going to be a volatile week. So don't just buy all in. I suggest splitting your money up 
and we're going to play it day by day, good people. All right. So uh, let's see here. September slides intense. Let's see here. Stocks tumble at the at the open. But this September, for those of you that don't know, for the last 20 years, this has been um, not a good week for the stock market. And so what do we do? We don't operate in fear. We look for opportunity. All right. So I'm going to wrap this video up by just um, giving you a list of all of the stock again that you need to consider buying in the case of a sell off by 10 percent or more. OK, some of these, a lot of these you don't need to, to wait until it discounts 10 percent. They're just good stock to have in your portfolio. So now what I'm concentrating on right now is to give you guys some stock that will balance your portfolio. And then we're going to have plenty of time to get these bangers, these hot stock. OK. And so I also have one other good thing that's really cool. Um, the Nigerian Nigerian brothers, uh, Pete and John Nigerian. John actually have a list of the stock that he's long on. And I'm also going to post those in this video. OK, so I'm going to end by showing you playing clips of just the stock picks. Take your pens out and write these. OK, good people. Uh, we'll see you later. All right. Peace. So let's go over stock moles pick. DraftKings, Tesla, Walt Disney Company and Coinbase. Now, stock mo actually um, also gave a bonus and the bonus was very interesting and i'll explain that at the end it is extremely interesting stock mo's bonus stock pick is voo which is vanguard s p 500 okay it's an etf you're buying the, the overall market all right Touch. So what i initially said is if they were discounted by 10 percent. so remember that for stock mo's picks also stock curry's picks are V W A G Y ticker symbol V W A G Y that's Volkswagen. All right. Uh, the second one is ticker symbol V A L E that's Vail. His third one is ticker symbol G S that's Goldman Sachs. And his fourth ticker symbol is C L F. Cleveland Cliffs, and you will find this one extremely, extremely uh, interesting. Uh, Matt Coors, I put the call out to Matt Coors, and he texted me back. He He's going to get to it. I think I'm going to have Matt Coors on the show, and then maybe we can talk about it then. Uh, he's busy. He's doing a lot of media. Everybody's pulling on him, so he's extremely busy. Get back at me, uh, Matt. Uncle Larry's calling. All right. <laughs> no, Matt is extremely. He, he told me he's he's going to do it. He's just trying to find some time. I understand. Trust me with these 80 hour weeks is no joke. All right. Let's keep it going. VUG. It's Vanguard Growth Index. VOO. There it is again. That's why it's interesting. Vanguard S&P 500 ETF. AAPL, ticker symbol, AAPL, that's Apple. And his fourth stock pick is MSFT, Microsoft. Now, remember, these gentlemen are, uh, are, are influencers just like I am. They're YouTubers just like I am. And remember, you have to do your own research and your own due diligence. This was just a question that I asked them and they answered. They're not your financial advisors. I want to say that for them. All right. But remember, I, I, I asked if they were at a 10 percent discount. My top four is ticker symbol AAPL. That's Apple. My second one is ticker symbol VOO. That's Vanguard, the S&P 500 ETF. So that's in three of our uh, stop st top stock picks all right my fourth one i want to stretch out a little bit is tesla t s 
Tesla. Tesla is a game changer. Tesla and Apple are world changers. And I believe that you should have these in your portfolio long term, 10, 20 years. These are retirement stock. These are never sales stock to me. Okay. These are set it and forget it stock that you should buy in a bull market, a bound, a, a, a bear market, a, a crash, a correction. You just keep dollar cost averaging in in these stock and you will create generational wealth. That's why I asked for this list.